Hello and welcome to my writing blog. My name is Tobias Malm and I am the writer behind the stories on this channel. This is my first attempt at making a video all by myself without the help of my brilliant friend Martin, but I hope that I will not disappoint. The reason I am making this video is because I have something to tell you. I'm going to write a novel. At least I'm going to try and vlog about it. I have been writing stories on No Sleep for quite a while now. And for you who don't know, No Sleep is a forum on Reddit, a so-called subreddit, dedicated to semi-realistic horror stories. The rule on No Sleep is that everyone, both the reader and the writer, has to pretend that the story is true, even if it's not. This helps with the story immersion and creates a cozy feeling, just as if you're sitting around the campfire telling about your own experiences with the unknown. If you like horror stories, I truly recommend that you visit No Sleep. And while you're at it, why not read some of my stories on No Sleep? I will put a link down in the description. A fair warning though, you might lose some sleep. I still have some unpublished stories that I will publish on No Sleep in the near future. But those will be my last stories in a while, because I'm planning on putting all of my focus on my novel. I don't know how long it will take for me to write a novel. My most optimistic estimate is about three months, and my most pessimistic estimate is about uh, a year or forever. Hopefully it won't come to that though. I've actually written novels in the past. They were all written in Swedish and were very existentialistic and pretentious and to no one's surprise they weren't published. One of them was about a depressed kid graduating school and no that was not about me I think. Another one was about another depressed man studying philosophy. Yeah that one was definitely a low-key autobiography. Luckily I've learned a lot from those projects at least I hope so. Knowledge that I can bring into my new novel. So what is my novel gonna be about? Before I came up with my idea, I wanted to know if my idea was good or not. However, how do you know that? In most cases, you can't know. You might end up spending months after months writing a novel, only to discover that no one liked it in the end. It's a gamble to begin writing a novel. Even with a lot of feedback during the process, you won't really know until you're done. And for most of us, we end up being the only one reading our stories. But isn't that enough? Isn't it pompous of us to care about what other people think? Shouldn't we write for our own sake only? I don't think so. I don't write because I enjoy writing so much. I write because I like telling stories. And if there's no one there to read my stories, it is as if they doesn't exist. After all, the story is what happens in the mind of the reader and not the ink on the paper. A closed book is like a painting hanging in the bottom of a well. Without the beholder, Art is reduced to atoms and empty space. At least that is how I justify my need to be read. I want my literature to exist. So for a long time I thought about what I could write that would appeal to people. My solution? No sleep. I have had some success in my stories there, although one of my latest stories only got like 11 upvotes. But I figured that if one of my short stories seemed to be liked by a lot of people on no sleep, Perhaps that would translate into a successful novel. At least it's a hint, right? So I have decided to turn one of my most successful stories on No Sleep into a novel. And the title of that story was Has anyone heard of this city? No one seems to remember it. And something horrific might have happened to it. The story received almost 10,000 upvotes and it does have the potential to be turned into something longer. So that's what I will attempt to do. And each week I will keep you updated on my progress, hence this little vlog. I believe that it will inspire me if someone chooses to follow me, and I also believe that it might inspire you to write more by following me. At least that is what I hope. If you want to see how it goes, I strongly recommend that you subscribe to this channel and press the little bell button so that you don't miss when new videos are released. Thank you for watching.